We are in Alta Floresta, state of Mato Grosso in Brazil. On a boat going up the river with Giselle. Giselle has been in the Amazon before, but it's new to her to be a correspondent, to be a reporter, and not just to be the subject of the story, but to be an explorer and ask questions. We're going towards a 800-year-old tree. And this tree represents everything about the rainforest, the importance of it, the preservation of it, the carbon that it holds, and the threat. I'm from Brazil. I grew up in a small little village in the south of Brazil. When I was a kid, I thought the rainforest is this invincible, massive forest that is indestructible. And as I grew up, I got faced with the sad reality that that's not the case. How can anyone want to destroy this? How can they do it, you know? This is the place with the most amazing biodiversity in the world. This is the castanha do Pará. This is a nut, and you can eat it. And that tree over there, that's where it comes from. There's a giant taking care of this forest. Before the Portuguese arrived in Brazil, these giants, they were watching the forest and now witnessing how the forest is being chopped down. And nowadays they can see. Unfortunately, they cannot talk. But we can talk for them. I'm going to do my best to speak for them. If a tree could talk, right? Imagine the knowledge of this tree. I mean, I realize even though it's so grand and magical, how fragile at the same time it is. I feel that it's my responsibility to try to do everything I can, you know, to protect it.